reach the distance that shows the gauge went on. What does this even mean? Um. Hello there, I'm Fitzmai Masa, I'm Wancha Chan. Today, Jamie is going to be a problem in the Kyo Dai Gaku Hoga Kubu. But first, I want to talk to you about a little bit about what I want to talk to you about. Wancha Chan has been offered a TikTok to you about the offer of TikTok. そうしたら TikTok を始めてほしいっていうですね、えー、TikTok はなんかもう語学にすごい力を入れてるんでその語学系の、えー、TikToker を探してるっていうことでですね、えー、正式になんか YouTube の僕のチャンネルを見て、えー、オファーが来ましたで前から実はやろうと思ってたんですよね大口先生とかとも話はしてたんですけど、えー、まあ今回正式にオファーが来たので、えー、始めようと思うんですが、まあ、どういったコンテンツを見たいかっていうのを皆様にちょっとですね聞きたいと思いますので、えー、ぜひぜひですねコメント欄にこういうのが見たいっていうのを、えー、送,送ってとか書いていただければなと思いますそんなに詳しくないので TikTok にはですね、えー、なので、えー、どういった語学系のコンテンツが見たいかっていうのを、えー、ぜひぜひ教えていただければなと思いますまあか今のところ考えているのは前から作ろうと思ってたのはそのジェイミーがいいろんな英語表現を紹介すするっていうものですねであとは大口先生のですね、まあ、Twitter でやってるような Twitter でやってるようなですねミニ講座、ね、文法だったりとか合法だったりとか、えー、そういったものを短い時間でパッと紹介するみたいなのを考えてますで自分自身もまあ何かやった方がいいんですけど、まあ、一体何をやるのかはまだ全然、えー、自分のは考えていないので、えー、その辺のこともですね何かヒントになるようなことをえー、書いていただければなと思いますのでぜひぜひお願いしますはいでそれ内容決まり次第あとは TikTok の人と今やり時きしてるので、えー、どんな感じでやるかみたいなのをが決まったらですね始めていきたいと思いますのでぜひぜひよろしくお願いします Today we are going back to KO University this time answering the business department questions section 5 um This is a paragraph of text, and you choose from the list of words at the bottom to slot in at each point. So, to save time, I will not be reading the whole text because it's quite long. That will take many minutes. So, I'm just going to answer the questions. I'm going to read it in my head, and I'll give you the answers and why. Uh, okay, answer to question number 44. Four generated. Question number 45. Answer one threat. Uh, number 46, I believe, is number four, patience. Question number 47, answer number four, complexity, I think. Question number 48, one, norm, short for normal. Question number 49, three, grasp, I think, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, definitely, grass.
deep reading and all that, it implies is vital to the ability of citizens in a healthy democracy to try on other perspectives and of not avoid, not wear, obscure or distinguish. Distinguish the truth? Or avoid obscure the truth? Okay, um, after reading it about four times in my head and once out loud, question number 50, I think, is number one. Answer number one, obscure. Appreciate beauty and go beyond reason or ourselves. Beyond ourselves in order to reach the wisdom that social engagement is a what? What does this even mean? Um, in order to reach the wisdom that social engagement is the foundation of a good society. Okay, I think the answer to question number 51 is three ourselves, which wraps up the questions for KO University Business Department, and I must say. That paragraph at the end might be the most difficult question I've answered on this channel so far. The sentences above weren't too bad. They were quite difficult, but not not difficult compared to um, the law department that we did last week. But this paragraph, like I'm struggling to understand this paragraph. If I had time and I could read it and annotate it and get through it slowly, I, I could tell you what it means, but this is an exam. You have limited time, of, of course, to read it, and I'm struggling to understand it quickly. So this is a really difficult text. Um, attempt at reading this paragraph. So I recorded this first a few weeks ago, um, and I didn't include it then. And then I had to re-record it two days ago, and had some technical problems, and also a misunderstanding. So today we're finally getting around to it, hence the new haircut, the new shirt, and different headphones as well. So, work in the science of the brain indicates that the acquisition of literacy generated a new circuit in the human brain more than 6,000 years ago. This reading circuit enables some of our most important intellectual processes, analogical reasoning, inference, perspective taking, and empathy. Research surfacing in many parts of the world now cautions that each of these essential deep reading operations may be under threat as we move into digital-based modes of reading. English literature scholar Mark Edmondson describes how many college students actively avoid classic literature of the 19th and 20th centuries because they no longer have the patience to read longer, more difficult texts. We should also be concerned with the inability to of a large number... Sorry. I'll start that again. We should also be concerned with the inability of large numbers of students to read with a level of critical analysis sufficient to comprehend the complexity of argument found in more demanding texts. Ziming Liu argues, Ziming Liu argues that the new norm in reading is skimming. Many readers sample the first line and then browse through the rest of a text. When the reading brain skims like this, there is no time to grasp the nuance, to understand another's feelings, perceive beauty, or create thoughts of our own. The subtle weakening uh, of critical analysis allows a retreat into the most familiar territories of unchecked information, which require no analysis, leaving us open to lies and deception. Deep reading, and all that it implies, is vital to the ability of citizens in a healthy democracy to try on other perspectives and distinguish the truth. To appreciate beauty and to go beyond reason in order to reach the wisdom that social engagement is the foundation of a good society. But anyway, that wraps up today's questions, so thank you very much for watching, and hopefully, I will see you next week, same time. Bye. Make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. See you next time. Take care.